Hello everybody! Now if I was filmed five minutes ago, I could have started by saying what beautiful weather it is, but the reality is it's starting to rain. So I guess the question that typically get asked, not necessarily directly, but people have it on their minds, is uh, what is next? Okay, you finish your race, like I've done, North Downs Bay 50. What is next? You kind of want to know, I guess, hopefully, what's on the horizon for me, and uh, I'll share with you some thoughts in just a moment. Hello sheep, hello. lambs, hello. Um, so hopefully by now you've seen my race, well not race even, my run that I did with Ben, pacing a 66.6 .6 mile ultra. Now, I didn't run the entire distance, of course, I ran the last 16 or so miles. And that kind of embodies what I want to be doing right now which is using my fitness and I would describe it as non-competitive fitness which is that I'm able to jump into a 5k, 10k, half marathon, marathon, maybe 50k and uh, complete it at my own time but I wouldn't be able to deliver any sort of PB or particularly fast effort because that's just where I'm at right now my fitness. So in being able to sit back and being able to look through races coming up my main criteria is does it sound like fun and there are certainly things out there that I could enter but to be perfectly honest with you when I think about them and I think about that criteria point the answer is no it doesn't sound like fun it sounds like you know I need to be entering it for a purpose um, or it's on a I don't know a trail or a path that I could run at my own time and not pay because my family money is also tight so I can't be frivolous and just throw money at the wall to enter a race that has no real kind of purpose and the purpose right now for me is to enjoy running to love it no pressure no expectations just turn up on the day take the GoPro out and document the experience the other factor of course is training and as it stands I've got no will or desire to enter a race that requires a specific training block and that involves in many aspects uh, sacrifice of family time and uh, I did that I did that for North Downs Bay 50 there were some sacrifices and actually I needed to have made more to get the result I wanted I wasn't willing to compromise on that and of course you may have your own thoughts and feelings but running for me is not my life I run for enjoyment, I run to, to just you know, share the experience. I don't run to jeopardise the people I care about. And I certainly would never pick running over my family. It's fantastic for my well-being, don't get me wrong. However, so are my family. And, uh, you know, right now, my daughter's in that kind of prime of her life. And I heard it quite recently, which is childhood. It's a springtime of life. What that means is spring being the shortest of the seasons. Childhood is exactly that. When you think about your life, the childhood part of it is the smallest, shortest part. And I want to be there to make sure she gets the very best she can. And so, yeah, I don't want to be jumping into something that means I've got to commit to a 16 week training block in order to participate fully. I just want to love it. And right now, what I do with Ben the other day, I loved. There were elements of challenge, but at the end of it, that high five, I just thought, that's what running's all about. Even now, you know, I'm running quick when it feels good. I'm not, I'm walking when I want to, because I can, I don't care about stats. I don't care about data, I care about how I feel in here. And in here so today I'm out for a run because I've had a busy one at work and it's good just for me to flush out those thoughts and uh, yeah there's no requirement to be at a certain pace to please myself to please subscribers sorry about that but uh, you know I don't want running to be something that makes me feel on edge anxious concerned worried I want to do something that's free and also I'm having fun it will be that 
I keep forgetting to end these videos. I just cut it off. It's only in editing. I go, oh, oh dear. I should probably say goodbye or something. So you know, with that, all that said and done, if you know of something that's fun, I'm in the south of the country, of England, of course, uh, just let me know and I'll have a little look. But that's kind of where I'm at right now. So hopefully that was relevant to some of you. And uh, yeah, I just want to have a bit of fun. We're running. So I'll catch up with you next one. Cheers for the likes, subscribes and shares, a lot of good stuff. See you soon.